Muhammad Hijab has a message for Israel. The difference between us and them is that for them, they think life begins. For us, we believe that death begins. We believe that life begins at death. We don't care about death. We love death. Hmm. Loving death more than life? Where have I heard that before? Terrorist funeral in the West Bank, 2023. <laughs> ISIS, 2015. We're coming for you, he says, with disturbing calm, with men who love death as much as you love life. Hamas, 2012. <laughs> Usama bin Laden, 2007. We love death. The U.S. loves life. That is the big difference between us. Khalid ibn Walid, 636. You should convert to Islam and then you will be safe. For if you don't, you should know that I have come to you with an army of men that love death as you love life. And of course, Muhammad. I would love to get martyred in the last cause and then get resurrected and then get martyred and then get resurrected again and then get martyred and then get resurrected again and then get martyred. But wait a minute. Hijab said those words more than two years ago and at some point he edited out We Love Death from his YouTube video. What does he say today? Surely there can be boots on grass. Hijab is a man of means. He could fly to Palestine. He could be brave. Real brave. He could be gallant. Real gallant. He could be courageous. Real courageous. So why isn't he? Does he lack fortitude? You have no fortitude at all. Is he a coward? You're cowardly. Surely this is something he can fathom. Which is something you can't fathom. Surely he can go fight face to face. Why don't we go face to face? So why hasn't he? Can we take him seriously? We can't take you seriously. What gives? Is he crying alligator tears? You're, you're crying with alligator tears. Come on, Hijab. Don't portray a comic book picture. Is this the comic book picture that you're trying to portray here? Be a man. You can be a man. A real man. Real men. Are you dumb? Are you dumb? Are you crazy? Are you crazy? Please tell me you aren't trying to fool your ignorant followers. You're trying to fool the ignorant. You must make a decision for those followers. You must make the decision for them. Don't make me sick. You make me sick. Don't. Just go on talking. But what's even worse is that you go on to talk about the Palestinians. Don't you realize this is your chance for vengeance? And we will get our vengeance! Don't you realize this is your chance for death? We love death! Stop waiting. Wait, wait a minute. Get off your butt and do what you demand your minions do. It will never happen! Yeah, that's what I thought. Absolutely sickening and disgusting. At least we finally agree on something. Oh. Allah Akbar!